All right, I'll tell you something about me. I'm kind of weird too. All right, I'll be honest with you. I'm <laughs> I know, I, I didn't see all the feet. But listen, on, on Instagram, girls are using that deer filter. <laughs> you know what they look hot. <laughs> girls look hot as deer. <laughs> so hot, dude. I would click. I would click for a deer chick all, all the time. All, I click for every deer chick. And when you click, the next picture is the same picture, but minus. The deer filter, right? Not as hot. Not, not as hot. Like, but I went, it went downhill fast, and I'm like, wait a minute. I was only into her as a deer? She's the part I didn't like. What did I just learn about me? On some backwards hillbilly shit. I didn't know. I was into deer. This is fucking me up. So I Google it. I said, right, let's see this filter. Let's get a better look at this filter seducing me. And I looked at it and I was like, okay, makes sense. Rosy cheeks, right? Right. Long lashes. Okay. Cute tiny little horns. <laughs> little tiny little cute little antlers, right? I was like, ah, alright. And I was like, wait a minute. <laughs> Girl deers don't have antlers. <laughs> Is so broke. I saw her walking down the street. I said, Lady, did you lose a shoe? She goes, Uh uh, I just found one. <laughs> you can take off your red shirt and put on a black one, but I still know Fat Albert when I see him. <laughs> you know, your mom's so stupid. I taught her the running man. I ain't seen that bitch since. <laughs> Your mom is so broke, she can't afford to freestyle. <laughs> Your mom is so broke, for Christmas, she brought home a tape of other people opening up presents. <laughs> Stop this madness! And for tonight's battle, the winner will be... Paul! <laughs> Brittany Griner got nine years in prison. It's horrible, and it's political, but on the upside, it is the longest contract anyone's ever offered a WNBA player. <laughs> <laughs> Just to be totally honest, it's, it's kind of an upside a little bit. Yeah, yeah, let that set in. Uh, and we know it's political because... <laughs> <laughs> we, we know it's political because Russia immediately offered to trade her for an international arms dealer in a U.S. prison. Um, it's not going to happen, but also the highest trade value ever offered for a WNBA player as well. <laughs> yeah, they've never cared this much ever about a WNBA player. She's getting more done for the league in court than on the court. <laughs> Homophobe is the wrong word. <laughs> it is. It's, it's the wrong word. It's, it, it's a horrible word for horrible people. People who hate gays. But phobe means fear. It's not hate, it's fear. So it's the wrong suffix. The word should be more like misogyny, hatred of women. Miso. Miso should be the prefix. So the word should be miso homo. <laughs> 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 what it should be. It should be me so homo. <laughs> Wouldn't it be great if the word that summarized the apex of tension between gays and straights was me so homo? <laughs> Wouldn't that end?
and they, everyone started laughing. Ah, me so homo, you so homo. Who are you? Who cares a shit? Who cares? It's just a hole, you know? Who cares? It does sound a little bit like an Asian guy telling you he's gay. Oh, me so homo. Oh. That's the part that got me canceled. I'm sure that's the part that got me canceled. That's why I can't, you can't take me out. It's just a little fun.